I know many of you have been asking about the one click website. This idea came to me when I saw a lot of people buying a particular product, which is this. And I'm like, well, I'll start a roofing company and maybe I could uh, sell it or flip it because check this out. If you go to a website like Flippa, you can see that e-commerce, uh, you know, health and beauty, Amazon, depending on if it's more of a, a seller account, a like a um, publishing account, or just an uh, associate, like a affiliate, you can just filter by recently sold. And if we go here, you can see this one sold for Netherlands. It was making a thousand euros, sold for thirty thousand dollars. 2,000 for 50,000, 1,000 for 20,000. So you could essentially build these up and then flip them, obviously like on Flippa, and make some decent money. Or just hold it as a cash flowing asset, just at, and have multiple of them. There's so many ways. So let's get into the good stuff now. So I actually started a new company website. I actually bought the domain roofingsupplyco.com, which is pretty cool because that's a really good domain name, I would think especially for SEO. And so I'm going to uh, base it out of Dallas because that's where I am. And I'm gonna show you how I would set this up. I'll be using different types of software. So there will be all a list down below so you have access to this. We also have our community of what, 54 people now and growing. So very excited to see all of those links are in the description. So if you wanna join our community, you're more than welcome to. It's where I have all of our one-click automations, all of our one-click downloads, and any questions that people have answers for, I help them there. So I'm just gonna activate WordPress on my site and then start building this out and show you exactly what this does. We're going to click Create WordPress and we're gonna put in our information. And now we are creating our website. So we can go into our live access right here. We'll just open that up. So WordPress is set up. I just need to point my domain to the right information and I'll show you how to do that. So we're gonna go ahead and go to add domain, domain name, roofingsupplyco.com. Configure your LL certification, which is super easy. And then you're gonna add these uh, A records. So I have an A record point Boom. And then we have our C record. That's saved too. We just need to verify. That was easy. Change this to primary. And now we have a live website. If you have questions about setting up a domain, go ahead and come to our community and ask there. So we're gonna create our local SEO buffet. We're gonna be using Zimwriter, but I asked both ChatGPT and Perplexity about uh, the, the service that I give and the USP and the benefits. And it pretty much gave me the, right, the, the same exact thing. So if we look here, uh, premium roofing material, uh, roofing material, we have rapid roofing material delivery, we have fast roofing material delivery, expert roofing, expert roofing, eco-friendly, eco-friendly, bulk, bulk. So I'm just gonna put that into Zimwrite. So I have my uh, information for my local SEO buffet that's gonna create all my pages, but obviously I don't have uh, 20 years of experience. I'm not gonna write things that are not true, but I mean, we do have fast delivery service. Uh, yeah, if we, if we get it, then we'll have an affiliate program you know, that delivers the pro product. Um, roofing materials, so this is the material um, and this is the stuff I just took from other perplexity too. I mean, it's the same exact information. It seems like they have similar uh, concept. So I'm gonna take this, put it into my uh, writer here, and then start my local SEO. This is where the fun begins because now all those files will be turned to a website page and moved into creating a page on my WordPress site. So Zimwriter likes to take your information and make this cute little buffet, right? You take a little bit of this dish, a little bit of that dish, uh, a little bit of feature list, you know, a little bit of this, and it makes it so that it creates kind of like a buffet, like, like I said. So I have all of this uh, metadata or markdown, and I'm gonna convert this into a, um, an actual website. So I use that through make. We have this, like I said, in our community. And so this is going to take this and turn it into those web pages for me. 
instantaneously. So let me show you how that works. So I have them uh, in my folder. I'm, all I'm gonna do is pull from the bottom um, to run this. So it might not even be up yet. So let's see. Yeah, so we'll grab these five. One, two, three, four, five. I believe that's how many I uh, chose for settings. Five. And now, so it's now it's gonna grab all five of these. Uh, download the file, parse them, replace uh, the text, turn it into HTML, create a website, and then upload it to WordPress. And so as of right now, if I go to my pages, all I have is a privacy policy and a sample page because it's that brand new website we just created. And so all I'm gonna do is push once. It's gonna push it through here, and now it's going through uh, Anthropic and then it's going to create my post and get my post. I actually probably don't even need to get my post. And now that I think of it, I was ha going to do something else with this, but it's no longer needed. So I'm just gonna uh, wait for this first one to, to post, and then I will uh, speed this along. Actually, I'll refresh, refresh the first page uh, so you can see the results, and then we'll, we'll go from there. Anthropic is taking a little bit, but luckily this is all automated where we're not doing this every time. We would have this run like depending on how often you do it. So now it's creating the post and there we go. So now it's going through number two. As you can see, it's right here, creating that HTML. And so if we refresh this page, you can see expert roofing consultant and support in Dallas, Texas. And then we can view this and we have our website here expertly made, um, looking pretty solid. And we could add some images and, and that sort of thing. But this is so far what we have just from a basic site. Uh, it's going to create those other pages for me and then we'll sp spice it up. I think we'll have a featured image here uh, and then we'll you know make this even better with automation. And there's number two, roofing materials. So again, if we bring that up, same similar thing. Uh, we would probably change some of the stuff here, but very basic layout, but we could, you know, build on this. And this is what we're going for is speed. So we have our topical authority here and we're going to just use uh, what we use for the pages for the local buffet roofing supply company in Dallas, Texas. And this is our clusters, long tails and blog posts. So we're just going to generate these. I already generated them. Um, I actually took, I believe it was these four, and then the last one was best roofing um, tools and supplies. So I'm actually show you those results. All right, so this is what it came up with. These were our, uh, the broad concept was roofing supply, topical cluster. So we have roofing material available in Dallas, local roofing contractors and services. I have some ideas for that. Commercial roofing supplies, and then residential options and pricing and then best roofing tools and supplies. And I think that's pretty pretty solid. These were the long tail, best roofing materials, affordable roofing, durable, eco-friendly, uh, best local roofing services near me, which is great. Uh, all of this stuff, and then this is the different posts. And all of this for 75, about 75 uh, posts gave me, cost me less than a penny, a 10th of a penny. So I can put all of these into, and I'll go through them uh, and put them into Zimwriter, uh, which is right here, and we can do the bulk writer. And so I can essentially just grab a bunch of these, paste this in here, and start bulk writer. So I have Zimwriter open, paste this in here. Uh, obviously I could do featured image. And then this is when we get into the, uh, the automation step. So I'm very excited about it, but and the link pack, which I'm very excited about, but if I wanted to create, say, 15, uh, 15 pictures, or sorry, 15 blog posts, I can really, really easy through the bulk writer. So I have about 10 blogs here out of the 75. I just went through and picked a few of them. I'll probably pick uh, like roundups and some of those other ones later, but I picked a few what is posts and a few other ones. And so I'm gonna be doing my settings here. I'm gonna make this, and then I'm gonna start building out the link pack so that I can use some of these other ones to add um, products, roundups, all sorts of things. So uh, let's get into this. I'm gonna go ahead and push bulk writer. It's gonna create 11 posts for me. 
and then it's going to well i'll show you next so you might be thinking brandon that's more than one click i know i know that so we are in coming up in part two we are going to automate a lot of this stuff we're kind of just seeing our choke points so right now uh there's a few Obviously, it's gathering the information for the company. It's uh, cleaning up the website, adding images, stuff that we need to do, adding a front web page. Um, a lot of it is going to be things we could then copy and load into Zimwriter. And I did just load up the WordPress automation uh, within Zimwriter. Also, I have one on Make. So, all right, and as you can see, we have all of our posts here already created in just a few minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and get to my sitemap, grab those links, those URLs, and then I can place them into Zimwriter's tool here. And now we'll start building my external and internal links. So I have my link post done, and I'm going to now add some more uh, articles. These are gonna actually have featured images, uh, subheadings, and subheading image. Uh, I'm going to have a progress bar. I'm gonna probably be doing one, two, like 12 uh, articles and I'll show you the results from that. But the difference is, is now these articles are included to uh, have WordPress. So I have them saved to my WordPress site. Um, it's gonna grab the uh, categories and the names of everyone. And I'm also having it do the link uh, pack. So we'll show you the results from that. And if you see here, we can actually schedule out the post. So I have it set for myself. Uh, no categories because the categories are in the, um, uh, the merge field. And then I do have them scheduled out for two posts every single day. And so I can do that. Uh, let me go ahead and select and categorize. Uh, it's going to actually do the categories for me, so I'm not too worried about that. And then I have my link pack, so I'm gonna add the roofing, so we can uh, do that. Insert, allow insertions into H3s and H4s. Um, set all links to do follow. Set links to open in a new window, and we can do that. And then if we wanted to scrape, we could. So if we wanted to enable SERP scraping, if we have um, scrape out, we can do that. We'll go ahead and click that. We have a style mimic, which we won't. We do have a custom outline that we made for uh, Amazon products, but uh, these are just tips. So I'm not gonna actually do that. I'll probably create those in a different video with a lot more automations. So I'm very excited to share with that in the second custom prompts, which we won't do at the moment and then YouTube videos. Uh, something to consider, I want to add probably my own YouTube videos, so I'll think of a custom prompt so I can start doing that, and we're going to go ahead and start this bulk writer. As you can see, 11 more uh, image, uh, posts, so we'll show you a few of the posts here in a moment, but uh, that is what we have so far. So now this is the three tips for essential roof pricing. And as you can see, I did do the subheading, the featured image. So it added the feature image here, has the three essential tips for pricing. This is the actual intro. Uh, it gives it the info right off the bat. And then my H2. So we have understanding material costs, has all the information here. Looks pretty sweet. Look at this image though. I mean, consider, consider a seasonal timing. And this image was created by, it looks like a professional, but it is by AI. It also included that little split for the seasonal time here, which is pretty sweet. And then the conclusion and all the frequently asked questions. So pretty sweet stuff here. I am going, I mean, this, this looks legit. I need to fix this, uh, the menu. But uh, other than that, like, this is uh, off to a good start. But as you can see here, it started to do my internal linking because it does have my uh, link pack. So if I click on this, it will bring me to my first page that I made with very basic stuff. And these are the pages, obviously, I'm going to update. I'm going to update my uh, uh, menu here. So there are some things I'm going to update here pretty soon. 
but this is just from using Zimwriter and using just a few clicks to, I mean, transform a website that's looking pretty sweet. I mean, I'm gonna just do one more thing to fix the menu and show you how that looks, but it's gonna be, it's gonna be great. All right, so we have our menu fixed. We're gonna obviously add more, um, but each new page from Zimwriter is going to have a image, uh, some subhead on a subheading, a featured image, and then it will have those linkable uh, backlinks uh, or external or internal links to something that makes sense uh, within our website. So leading roofing supply distribution. So quite a bit in all of the images. So now these are all scheduled and I'm going to start taking some of these things like say for instance, energy saving roofing options, asphalt and start creating pages off of all of these. So metal roofing, clay tiles, concrete tiles, um, slate roofing. So I'll create all of those for different products and categories and then write articles based off that and continue this process with uh, using both the Zimwriter and the ChatGPT or Anthropic and all these images to create backlinks, create links that uh, are able to <laughs> create a lot of stuff. So I'm very excited to share this with you guys as I continue on this um, website that I just started uh, with just a few clicks. And so I will give you guys updates. I'll be probably creating a few niche websites uh, to show you the results. Um, I've realized that as I've done these, the, the videos that are more step-by-step -step tend to push me back. So I'm just gonna share results of these websites. And uh, if you guys want to join our community and get a deeper dive on uh, how to set everything up, you can definitely join our community, uh, which we have, I believe now, 50, what is it, 55 people? Let's check. Maybe 54, so we have a, boom, let's pull it up. 54 people and growing. So very exciting stuff. And until next time, guys, remember to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.